guys, welcome or welcome back. It's Buttercup here and today you are joining me for our yearly Pokemon compilation. I've done this for the past two years in a row, now making it the third. And basically this is where I compile all of the reactions throughout the past year from our shiny hunting and put them into one video for you guys to enjoy. While this year wasn't the biggest in terms of quantity for a lot of the hunts that I did, there were so many quality hunts I feel that we completed this year. There were so many more legendaries than I've done any other year. So that was a really big accomplishment for me and going forward I definitely have so many more exciting hunts that I want to do and plenty more legendary hunts which I'm so excited for in 2024. Of course I've got to say a huge thank you to everybody who has supported me this year. You guys know it was a bit of a slow start but we've gotten back into things and I'm so so appreciative to you all and as always I wish you guys all the best of luck on your own shiny hunts. I'm going to keep the intro short and sweet. Let's get into the reactions. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Are we gonna get it, you guys? No, <laughs> it doesn't even shake once. Oh my gosh, I can't believe we finally found it. Like, I just... Wow, incredible. And there we go. Time to throw our Arceus into battle. Oh my gosh, it has been a while since I've got to see the sparkles in the overworld like this. Oh my gosh. I need a second. I cannot believe I'm looking at shiny Alpha Lucario right now. You guys know, you know how long I have been working on this hunt. Oh my gosh. I, I can't even believe it. I can't, I can't even believe it. you guys know we have been working on this hunt for so i have tears in my eyes oh my gosh i we have been working on this hunt for such a long time i i can't believe it i can't believe we're looking at this on the screen right now this doesn't even feel real like this is why i love shiny hunting for this feeling right now i cannot believe it <sighs> let's throw our sylveon in and let's catch this thing Oh my gosh, shiny Alpha Lucario. There's no way. There's no way. This has, this has been a journey. This has been a hunt. I am, I told myself, you know, I said this year is the year I'm going to get the Lucario. I'm going to make it happen. I want to get it done before the end of 2023. I need to do that. I need to do that. And here we are actually making it happen. I mean, oh my goodness. I don't even know what to say right now. Okay. Oh my goodness. I am just in shock right now. It looks incredible. I just have to say, I love Lucario shiny. I think it looks absolutely amazing. And there we go. We've caught it. The hunt for shiny Alpha Lucario is finally, finally over. I am, oh my gosh. I don't have words right now. I, re I really don't. Shiny Obstagoon! Yes! Let's go, Shiny Galarian Obstagoon! Or well, Galarian Obstagoon, it's just Obstagoon. <laughs> now we have the fun task of catching this cutie. Now I think a great ball feels like the obvious way to go. I don't know about you guys, but red and blue, surely. Surely. <laughs> so let's get to throwing some Pokeballs and see if we can catch this little cutie. I am. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy we got this shiny, you guys. This is why I love hunting in Sword and Shield. It's just so much fun and there are so many great targets. 
but we have caught the other dude and on our first great ball. I love this Pokemon so much. I think it's so goofy, but the design, the shiny colorway, it looks fantastic. Or are you wishing us uh, shiny luck? I appreciate that if you're wishing us shiny luck and I'm, I'm wishing the same back to you. Do you watch anime? If you do, what's your favorite? I do watch anime. I've been watching watching a lot of anime, to be honest with you, uh, because I haven't really had a lot of time to do much else, so I just fall asleep with- <gasps> SHINY SPRIGATINO! We did it! <laughs> we actually got it! SHINY SPRIGATINO! Oh my gosh, I've probably blown out everybody's ears! <laughs> Shiny Sprigatito. It looks really good. Ooh. Oh, nice. I like it. Okay, cool. So uh, that's kind of along the lines of what I was expecting. It was it was very short-lived, <laughs> Florigato. I'm glad I got to see your shiny. But it is time now to see Shiny Mascarada. Oh, it looks great. I love it. 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 There we go. I'm going to be honest, despite what everyone thinks, I actually really like this shiny. I really, really do. It's subtle, but it looks really nice. It's clean. The purple looks great. It's a really nice change in my opinion. I'm not going to complain. I'm so happy. Thank you guys for keeping me company while we hatch the next today. <gasps> shiny Toxel! <gasps> Let's go! <laughs> Shiny Toxel! Oh! Oh, the shiny looks great! <laughs> oh, I'm so glad we got this today! Shiny Toxel, let's go! This little baby, angie looking electric lizard. But with that, it is time now to do our nature guess. I think for this little cutie, I want to say calm nature. I don't know why, that's just what I'm feeling. Let's check. Oh, we do! We do actually have a mark. Oh, that's awesome! I was gonna say, let's check if we have any marks. <laughs> awesome! We've got the uncommon mark, um, the sociable. Ooh, ribbon, that's super cool. Toxel, the sociable. This little guy does not look like it wants anything to do with being social, but, you know, I'm gonna disregard that. That's okay. Because this is our third outbreak. For those of you who have been doing the outbreaks, how many did it take for you to, uh, for you to get the shiny? Wait, is that one there? There's a shiny milsery as I say that. Let's go. Yes, a shiny milsery. I thought it looked a little different. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, let's go early into the stream. Let's freaking go. Yes. Shiny milsery. What a cutie. I love it. Let's see the sparkles on this cutie. It's so cute. I love it. I love it so much. Yes, her, uh, after I hopefully get a shiny mini I'll do the Milsery Outbreak with my eyes. And let's go! Milsery critical capture in the love ball. Oh, oh my gosh. Shiny Bibble, let's go! Oh my gosh, I, I'm glad I realized my mic was muted. Shiny Bibble. <laughs> oh my god, and it's a female. I was really hoping that it would be. I think we might try. I think we might try a couple luxury balls and just see how we go. And then if we don't get it, I think the ultra ball is gonna be the go to. Are we gonna get lucky and catch it on the first luxury ball? <gasps> Shiny! No way! Shiny Poltergeist! Are you serious? Oh my gosh, a shiny poltergeist. I I cannot believe it. What? You guys are gonna have to you guys are gonna have to bear with me for a second here because oh my gosh. I was not I was not expecting to get this today. Oh, I thought we were gonna catch it. <laughs> but you know, sometimes buttercup is um a bit un No! We just failed it! I'm gonna cry. I'm actually gonna cry. <laughs> I'll be back.
<gasps> Shiny Poltergeist! Let's go! <laughs> oh my gosh, Shiny Poltergeist! Oh, I'm so, so happy we found this cutie again. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay. The Pokeball will fit super nicely with this shiny. I think this will be... No, this will be the second time I've thrown a Master Ball on the channel because I did end up using my one in Shining Pearl on Arceus. So we're going to go ahead. And we're going to throw the Master Ball. And we're going to secure the catch on Shiny Poltergeist. I think it's going to look amazing. Without further hesitation. <laughs> Let's secure this shiny this time. Like I said, I was so in between. But I actually think it looks really, really nice with the Master Ball. I'm not upset about that. I think it's gonna look, well, I think it does look amazing. Wait, is that a shiny Applin? Let's go! Oh, shiny Applin! <laughs> I was hoping we would find one of these little cuties. Oh my goodness. I have been meaning to go for this little guy in Scarlet and Violet for a while now. All right, let's see if we can bump it down. And there we go. Oh goodness. Let's run over and counter it. There we go. A shiny Applin. What an absolute cutie. I love this Pokemon so, so much. I love food themed Pokemon. Appleton was actually one of my favorite Pokemon to come out of the Sword and Shield games. And I don't know how they managed to make a third variation that I say sits alongside that with Diplin. I just think it's so, so cool. Oh my gosh. What a little cutie. We need to catch this guy in a Pokeball. I like how I say that like I'm gonna catch it in something else. I don't really have many options, Buttercup. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I, I, yeah, it's been a while since I've actually decided to do my Sparkling Power Shiny Sandwich Hunt. I've just kind of put it on the back burner. There we go with the critical capture. That's so good. Oh, what a cutie shiny Applin in Violet. I'm so happy about that. Here we go. Time to check out this cutie and its shiny form for the first time. I'm so excited. Oh, let's go Applin. Shiny Applin or Shiny Diplin. Oh my gosh, I can't even speak. I'm so, I'm so all over the place. I still cannot believe how quick we managed to get this shiny. to check for any marks or ribbons and do our nature guess now for our nature guess i think i am going to say careful i don't know why that's just what i'm feeling right now so we're gonna go ahead and check no marks or ribbons that's okay i kind of expected that and for the nature it is careful oh my god we got it right <laughs> we got it right let's go oh it's been a moment it's been a moment since i've got a nature guess right uh, for some v bucks sounds good save the world yep no i get that i get that well, I hope the stream can help as well for you. Fingers crossed it can at least be a little bit of a distraction for the time being. Hopefully we can get the shiny croc. That would be nice. <gasps> what? <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> There's no just want to very quickly throw this little cutie out and have a little look at our little shiny fire croc in the overworld. Oh my goodness, Fuecoco just looks so, so cute. I really love this shiny. The pastel colorway looks absolutely amazing. It's, oh my gosh, it's running around us in circles. That is so, so precious. Wait, is that shiny Reggie Ice? <gasps> we just got shiny Reggie Ice! Let's go, you guys! <gasps> I thought it looked different. <laughs> oh my gosh, what a delayed reaction. <laughs> I can't believe we just found 
just showing you pictures. I was watching a video and I was like, oh yeah, no, I'll, I'll definitely notice when it pops up on the screen. And then I just, I caught the sparkles at the last minute. Oh my gosh, I would have been so upset if I reset her. <laughs> But we shall see how we go. I'm just so glad we finally got this thing. <laughs> I've been hunting this one for a while, on and off for the past, I'd say, maybe six months or so. And I didn't want to tell you guys until we got it, but there it is. We secured it in a quick pull. I'm kind of surprised. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure after that first throw, it goes down to the same effectiveness as a Pokeball. So I am just, I'm so excited. <laughs> Back in route one, so we could finally throw our red dice out into battle with a sweet little Wooloo. It's been a moment, Wooloo. How are you? I missed you. <laughs> oh, and our fantastic shiny red dice. Wait. <gasps> shiny Pochi guys, let's go. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought I could tell the difference. Is it the lighting? Is that what it is that threw me off there? Oh, wow. It's it's kind of more subtle than I was expecting, but dang, shiny poltergeist, finally. Just over 3,000 eggs. I think this is just under 3,100 eggs, if if I'm mathing right right now, which I might not be because I'm a little bit tired. It's pretty late right now for me. I'm just so glad that we got it. It is time to throw our little matcha pot out into the overworld. Yeah, like just looking at it, it looks super, super subtle in the overworld. I'm guessing it's the time of day, but even though it is like a pretty subtle change, at least in the overworld, I think it's a very fitting change. I mean, I don't know what else they could have done in my opinion to make this a more fitting shiny for this Pokemon's theme. And I mean, I think the thing that really sells me on this is just like its face. I love Poltergeist, Poltergeist and Sinistee's face. I think it is so, so cute. The little spooky ghost that resides in it. Like, I just love it so, so much. but just genuinely i i don't know i wow <laughs> oh my gosh shiny absol what an amazing shiny i personally really like this one i like how it kind of reminds me of well the original absol reminds me of like the yin and yang i think you guys can kind of see what i mean with that with the black and white this one i don't know why it just reminds me of like a little sunburnt a little sunburnt bean i don't know i like it though <laughs> i'm not too sure what i'm gonna do if we use perish song here because obviously once it lands we've only got three turns and then it's just hoping that we manage to get it in a pokeball but unless we get super lucky and we catch it on the first pokeball we throw <laughs> what okay i will take that <gasps> shiny comfy <gasps> let's go Oh my gosh, I nearly missed it. <laughs> Shiny Comfy, oh. My muscle memory wanted me, re me to reset so badly then I can't even talk. <laughs> so I'm gonna take that as everything happens for a reason. And that quick ball was not our ball for this shiny. I'm feeling the dive ball. I'm probably gonna chuck a few more of these before we try and get the heal ball a go because I'm just feeling the blue a lot on this one. And are we gonna get it? We do, we got the shiny comfy. And here we are in the overworld, just taking a look at our sweet little comfy up on the land, hovering around. I thought the beach would be the perfect place to showcase the shiny. Hmm. I think that maybe if you're doing encounters, Tatsugiri could be cool. If you aren't feeling encounters and you want to do a Masuda hunt, you could go Tadbulb because I feel like Tadbulb would actually be easier to hunt through. <gasps> shiny Quaxley! Set off. I gotta take my headset off. No way! <laughs> shiny Quack, are you serious? <laughs> That's our second shiny in the stream today. Are you actually serious? What is going on? <laughs> what is going on right now? It looks so good. It looks so good. Oh my gosh. 
long. Now I think it's time to throw our little Quaxley out into the overworld so we can have a look at it. Oh my goodness, what an absolute cutie. I love this shiny so, so much. I actually think that so far with Sprigatito and Quaxley just like Two out of three that we've gotten, I think they're great shiny starters. I thought that they would be a lot more subtle, but I feel like looking at them in game, I actually really, really like the change that they make. In a way, like I I have been the shiny hunter. Is that a shiny? Are you serious? Are you serious? <laughs> this isn't a <our> target! <laughs> okay, that's... Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. I need to change my Pokemon. That's a level 39. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're gonna be smart here and we're gonna we're gonna trade over. We're gonna change our Pokemon. We're just gonna shiny Coco. We'll keep throwing the nest balls. I don't have that many. I really, really need to stock up on Pokemon. That's a critical capture. That's a critical capture. There we go. Shiny Coco. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, I'm so happy. What a way to come back to the streams. Sorry, I'm back. No, I definitely get that. I would say I feel better mentally. Uh, oh! Shiny Frozen! <laughs> no way! We actually did it! I am so sorry if I just blew out everybody's ears! I recommend it to you. Uh, you guessed it. It's an intelligent and very well-written show with lovable and deep characters and arcs. Oh, that's awesome. I've heard a lot of really good things about it, so I don't blame you. And we caught it! Ah, oh, oh, We caught the Verizian. It looks great. Oh my gosh. Shiny Verizian. What an absolute cutie. This, yeah, like I said, Verizian has to be my personal favorite of the, uh, Swords of Justice trio for its shiny and for its original design so I really did want to do this one on stream with you guys so I'm glad to say that it paid off especially after all of those pokeballs I'm glad you guys uh, had faith in me that we could catch it in the end so I I really I really can't complain here's our Wooloo it's time time to encounter imagine imagine if we got another shiny I'd probably lose my mind okay it's just a regular Wooloo I don't think my heart could have taken a shiny Wooloo as well Oh, Terrakian? I was thinking Terrakian, but we shall see. Wait, is it a shiny Chocolate? <gasps> no way! Let's go! I could barely tell, but I saw the blue to encounter it and see those sparkles. Let's go! Oh my gosh. It looks so good. I need to I need to run that back. I want to see the sparkles straight on. There we are. <laughs> Those are the sparkles I was looking for. I think I'm pretty sold on the Great Ball for this, which is kind of cool because it's actually been quite a while since I caught a shiny and a Great Ball. So let's go ahead and get throwing. It's only level 14, so I don't think we'll have too much trouble catching this thing, but we shall see. And there we go. Oh, oh, I don't <gasps> shiny! But it is time to get the sparkles. Oh, it looks so good, shiny with chalky, guys. Oh my gosh, it's an incredible shiny. I've been wanting to find this pink little piggy now for a couple of weeks, so I am so glad to say that we actually did get it. Well, I have to catch it. I have to catch it. I'm getting ahead of myself again. And we just caught it. Oh my gosh, I am so, so excited. <gasps> no way, we just got Shiny Pangoro! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Let's go, Shiny Pangoro! Oh my gosh! Oh, it looks so good! Oh my goodness! I was really hoping we would find this shiny tonight. I'm not gonna lie, I've been hunting. How many hours today? Oh, I don't even wanna, I don't even wanna know. I think I've hunted for like nearly, it's like 2 a.m. now. I think I've hunted for like 15 hours today alone on this shiny, well on this target I should say. I'm thinking maybe we could go for the level ball since we have the Sylveon at level 100. Um, I didn't do any test uh, battles on Pengar. I didn't bring any Pokemon to kind of weaken it. So guys, you're gonna have to wish me luck on this one. <laughs> <laughs> Go level ball. Let's see if we can get lucky, you guys. Hopefully we can. Ooh, one, two, three. Yes, we did it. We actually got a 
shiny in one of the Pokeballs that we only managed to get one or two of. Oh, that feels so good. You have no idea. <laughs> I wanted to go out the front of the dojo because I just thought it would be so perfect for this shiny. Pungaroo just, like I said, reminds me of Panda so much, so I thought this would be kind of cool to show it off around here near the dojo, and I think this thing looks sweet. I love its little run. It's so cute. <laughs> Another shiny Opalus. Let's go. <gasps> shiny Ariados! Let's go! <gasps> no way! Oh my gosh! Shiny Ariados! Let's go! go our first spider of this october oh my goodness let's get a little bit closer because i don't want this thing to despawn wow i i love ariadosa shiny so so much i think it looks amazing we gotta encounter this thing you guys oh my gosh shiny ariados no way it looks amazing you guys and i don't know what it is i always remember you know ariadosa shiny and i'm like oh okay i feel like i always used to prefer spinarak more but there's something about ariados in this game with its shiny that i just i'm really really liking it looks amazing which i think we should be okay honestly in terms of pokeballs a heal ball would look super nice Ooh, a heal ball or a quick ball i think because of the arms and like, I guess it's legs. The he the quick ball could be a really good choice. So I might throw one of these. And then if this doesn't work, I will throw heal balls until, you know, we either catch it or that doesn't work. So we'll just see how we go. We might not, yeah, I didn't, I didn't think we would get that one that quickly. <laughs> but Ariados is shiny. I just, oh man, I love this color palette so much. And we got a critical capture. Does that mean? It does. Oh, I'm glad because I, I'm not going to lie. Secretly, I did want to end the heal ball more. So I am very, very happy about that. Okay, okay. Well, it's time to time to encounter this thing. Oh, not you. <laughs> I like the buzz. We are here. The shiny duskull. No way. I cannot believe. I cannot believe we're looking at this thing right now. I think it's only right that we do throw this little guy into battle here with snow run let's get those sparkles i like that this is something that they did in legends i wish that they would have kept in violent skull and now dust goes knocked out <laughs> what am i doing i'm struggling that's what i'm doing well we'll just do this i suppose oh it's the shiny that's why i didn't want to attack it <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> that makes a lot more sense that makes a lot more sense i was like why I don't want to attack this little baby. Oh my gosh. What? <laughs> Shiny for baby. Let's go. I was like, Meow Scarada, what are you doing? Are you tired? Like, come on. You got it in you. Let's. And I was like, ah. Uh, Let's just battle it. Let's get it out of the way. Oh my gosh, shiny Flabebe. So I'm gonna go ahead and just start throwing these because I, I don't actually know what the test battle on this is gonna be like. And I mean, I'm honestly not too fast anyway. I mean, I guess I could exit out, but we catch it on the first heal ball. What is happening? Just when somebody asks for some of your luck, well, there you go. There's some luck for you as well. <laughs> shiny Mancino. Oh, not Mancino, Chinchino. Oh my gosh. I was not expecting that. <laughs> it is time for our encounter on Rat Wooloo. It is a regular Wooloo. As per usual, that is okay with me. We are here to see the sparkles on our shiny chinchino. What is that? <gasps> shiny tarantula! <laughs> no way! Oh my gosh! I go to the toilet and I come back and <laughs> to It just reminds me like how few red shiny Pokemon there actually are. But they definitely like got it right with this one. Oh my god, what is it <laughs> I feel like it would look the best in a Pokeball, ironically enough. And it is only a level 8, but I did only bring 16 regular Pokeballs because I don't really tend to use them that much. So I'm gonna say screw it. We're just gonna throw some Pokeballs. Hopefully we can catch this thing because I don't... Oh, actually I do have... Oh wait, no. Before I get carried away, critical capsule! <gasps> Shiny Shinodic! Let's go! We did it! No way! Oh my gosh, Shiny Shinodic! This is my target! You're actually kidding me right now. Oh my gosh. I did not expect 
expect to actually get our target from a wild encounter as our first phase. We will see. A luxury ball could also look really nice too. Imagine if there was a Pokeball with like that ties in like the green and like the autumny colors. I just, I don't know. I think it's super, super nice, which is funny because now here in Australia, it's technically about to become spring, but who cares? I don't. <laughs> I'm just so happy we got the shiny and we caught it. Shiny Shinodic. That is so, so awesome. I'm so excited. As much as I would have loved to have done the overworld encounter in Glimwood Tangle, unfortunately, we can't have our Shinodic out in the overworld. So I've come here to the Dino Hill tree once again to showcase our adorable shiny in the overworld. I love this colorway. I think it's super, super unique. The brown, the whitey cream color with the lime green and then like the orange. I don't know. I just, I this is the only Pokemon I can think of the top of my head with this colorway and I think it looks amazing. However, I did read your dex entry and I am a little bit scared of you now. <laughs> I was not anticipating finding this so quickly. Oh my gosh, you guys. Let's encounter this thing because I want to see the sparkles. What? A shiny toad school on our first day of hunting it and it looks incredible. We're going to go ahead and do that. Oh, we got a dash bun, but that is no match. There we go for our shiny toad school. And I made me see video. Hello, welcome. Lovely to see you. We're hatching our last couple eggs, but it is great to see you in the stream. Uh, I'm doing fantastic. Just got the red and white shiny floor babies. Oh, let's go. Yeah, you guys were telling me. Thank you, by the way, for letting me know about those outbreaks. I did not know. So, <gasps> shiny tandemus! What? <laughs> no way! <laughs> no way! We actually got it at the end of the stream. There is no way, guys, I need to get up. I need to get up, oh my gosh. We actually got the tandem mouse. We actually got it. <gasps> Shiny double, let's go. Oh, <laughs> that, was, that was actually pretty quick. I'm not gonna lie, that was actually pretty quick. Shiny double with the square sparkles. How good does it look? Oh my gosh. <gasps> Well, I'll track an Ultra Ball this time. We can at least take, it can take, I think, probably two to three more bouts of recoil moves. So hopefully we'll get lucky and catch it here, maybe. Yes, we do. Oh, that's good. The beautiful part about being in the DLC area for this hunt is I get to see our little double shiny in the overworld and look at it go. Oh my goodness. That is so cute. I feel like I need an animation of Double just, you know, hopping over the fence. You know how they say counting sheep to fall asleep? I feel like Double for that would be just so, so cute. <gasps> Shiny Bunsley! Yo! <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Wait, I should stand back and do it. I just gotta, I gotta encounter it. Don't mind me, you guys. I've wanted this shiny for such a long time and it's female, very cute. Hopefully we get lucky and we can catch this thing. I'm not sure. Oh, critical capture. That's what I like to see. And we got it. First ball. Is that the shiny? Is that actually the shiny? That's the shiny Litwick, isn't it? That's shiny Litwick. <laughs> yes, it is. I was like, wait a minute. That looks a bit more blue. I was like, no, they don't have slight color variation. They all look the same. Another female too. Shiny Litwick, what is happening right now, you guys? So I think I'll go ahead and I'll do the dive balls. Let's just start throwing because this one might be a little bit difficult since it is level 70 and you guys are saying it knows memento, so I'm not gonna risk that. Let's just, let's just get chucking and see. And we catch it on the first ball? Are you serious? Shiny Shirtle! Let's go! We did it! Oh my gosh! Finally, Shiny Shirtle! I saw the pink and I wasn't too sure. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. What a little cutie. And you guys know, I'm, I'm especially excited because it's pink. Oh my gosh, Shiny Shirtle, let's go! I have been wanting to do this hunt for a while now. Like, honestly, I was thinking about it in like December last year. Um, this little guy kind of reminds me of like the mad scientist from Luigi's Mansion. Do you kind of 
You understand what I'm saying? I don't know. I, for some reason, I just see it and I think it's it's so goofy. I love it. Let's have a little look up close. Oh, yes! Shiny Shrudel. It looks great and it's a female. Oh my gosh, I love those eyes and the little tongue. I mean, I guess it's like a pinky purple, but like, listen, I'm not... I'm not gonna complain, but we don't have any at the moment, so I'm just gonna go and stick with our heal ball, which we've got a critical capture, which means we are gonna go ahead and secure ourselves our pink little shiny shrudel. Yeah. <gasps> shiny Graydon! No way! <gasps> no way! Shiny Graydon! <laughs> we have finally got! Oh my gosh! <gasps> The shiny burgundy squirrel! Oh my goodness! How long have I been going for today just with this session alone? Over five hours just in this session. This is by no means all I hunted for this little guy. And it's a female! Oh my gosh, it's so cute! Shiny female squavit! No way! I was gonna bring our squavit anywhere in the overworld to chuck out and have a look at it running around. We had to, of course, bring it to the Dino Tree Hill. You can see we've got Greed and hanging around over there. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous because, you know, our um, little squabbit here is only like a level five. So if we run into a battle with any Pokemon here, we are, we're in big trouble. And there we are wrapping up another year. I just wanna say a huge thank you again to everyone who has supported myself on the channel. You guys are the absolute best community anyone could ever ask for. And here's to another exciting year of shinies ahead. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.